<laughs> hey guys, we're Rare Adventure. How's it going? Make sure you subscribe, ring the bell, or like us, and uh, right. keep following us. Because <laughs> you'll never know what you might find. <laughs> okay, anyway, so today is car buying day because, well, we're about to get rid of a lease and buy a car. Like, buy a car, not lease a car. So, we'll get you on our story, and hopefully you guys can learn a bit of, about why you buy from certain people and you don't buy from other people. <laughs> So we're looking at cars and Grace is playing, um, well she was playing, are you playing corn res or cornhole or whatever this is? You like this car? You think that we should buy this car? I'm buying stuff for her. Hey Ava, what about this car? Nah. Nah, okay so Ava says we don't need a convertible. Yes we do. Um, Grace would want a convertible. This is a Buick. Let's see, this is a Buick Encore. This is pretty nice, so I don't know. I'm kind of biased to not necessarily get another SUV because we already own one. So um, we've looked at several cars, and I think we're narrowing it down. Um, but we're going to keep looking and see what happens. All right, so we're going to buy a car today, and I have a few questions for you. Yes. What makes a dealership different from every, your dealership different from everyone else's dealership? The people working there. Is it just the people working there, or is it the way that you, when you say the people working there, how do you describe that? I would say the attitude and the energy. A lot of people feel a little bit too encumbersome when people come in to the store. We make it a little bit more relaxed. So uh, you're not vultury type not people. Not vultury type. Buying a car is pretty easy today. People are pretty smart and as they should be. And uh, it's just having a conversation with somebody and problem solving with them. All right, so if someone comes in and says, I have this and this is what I want, then you can basically like help them through that process really versus quickly, like yes. trying to say, oh, well, I have this great car for you and it's the best price, but yet it's nothing they want. You're not going to push them into something that's, like that. That's correct. Yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's an easy thing to outshine people online. And it's also really easy for people to dog you online. And so it's extremely important for dealerships to roll out the red carpet. Just really listen and help them problem solve. Like I said, it's, uh, it's pretty easy, actually. Okay, so <laughs> one last question and you don't have to answer this or you can't answer it, but um, we are currently at a dealership and would you like to give the name of the dealership so that we can give you a shout out online? Yeah, this is Value Car Off of Academy in Bijou. We are the number one store out of the entire Phil Long group and it's the largest dealer in the state of Colorado. All right, and what makes Phil Long better than some other dealership? It's a family owned company. They've been around since 1945. Uh, they do a 43 point inspection compared to their competitors that do a 12, which makes me feel very good as a family man selling pre-owned vehicles. They've been looked at very thoroughly and it's much more like a very professional service shop that offers vehicles for sale rather than just a car lot trying to sell a car. Got it. All right, thank you for your time. Yeah, and can you. I get your name so if right. anyone needs to come buy a car, then talk to you. That's right. My name's Caleb Loy. Come ask for me. And don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell. All right. Thank <laughs> you. Recording now. Okay, ready? Try. Who's gonna win? Almost. Go you realize she has an advantage because yeah. <laughs> she just cheated. <laughs> All right, you better go again. You're getting a little close. Thanks for knocking mine down. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there you go. You got the last one. Oh, oh. That, that takes some talent. Are you going to switch it up? Oh. 
Oh, get your bean bag. You better get it. You're supposed to stay on that line, remember. Okay. Go first. All right. Who's going to win? Almost. Ooh, Dad. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, Look man. at Dad do that, Dan. Hey, guys. So, um, we have been looking for a new car because Josh's lease is up here in a couple months. Three months. Three payments. Um, so, what... With that, it's kind of like, what do we do? Do we get a new one? Do we not get a new one? So, of course, at the beginning of this video, you did see that we are looking for a new car. We have interviewed um, a car dealership that we really like. Mm -hmm. um, I would say we really like them, don't you? Yeah, they did really well. Um, just the thing that we kind of had a hard time with, uh, we were looking at, we initially went there looking at the Jeep Gladiator. Um, we... Uh, test drove and and kind of got a feel for the Wrangler to see if that would work for us. Which we found a Wrangler we loved. Yes, we did. But um, we got our snow. precious daughter uh, has this crazy chair of hers that's like huge. And yes. with and the snow, and it's in two parts. So with snow, yes. Yeah, with the snow and everything, we um, we got to kind of experience a challenge that having a Wrangler just on its own would present for us uh, on a routine basis, especially being here. In Colorado or, or anywhere else where we may have some um, inclement weather that we would have to put her uh, one part on the ground have it get soaking wet uh, while we take the other part out and then getting it all put together um, is not fun for something that totals 90 pounds no. um, at all um, so so Our, they were kind enough to let us actually take it for, it was supposed to be a 24-hour period, um, ended up being two and a half days, actually, yep. um, which actually was really cool because um, with most car dealerships, they would say, take an hour test drive, take 20-minute test drive, and yeah, we're going to sell you a car. Well, yeah. that sucks. I'm going to be really honest. So um, Value Car um, on Academy here in the Springs has been amazing to work with, and I cannot say anything more than right now they are on the search for a gladiator that has what we want on it so mm -hmm. that we can have the bed for putting Grace's chair in. And, well, not just that, but we kind of would like to at some point um, figure out life a little bit different than what we currently live in and um, maybe adventure a little bit different than we do. Um, so... We're kind of trying to just um, be prepared for the future because we hate buying cars again and again, but that seems to be our future. So our, our past, um, we don't want that to be the future. Yeah. Um, so I would say um, this video is to be continued because we don't know where or what or how we're going to end up getting the vehicle we want. Um, but we do know, and I guess Josh can probably agree with this, um, we definitely feel that value car... Um, by Phil Long was the best car buying experience for trying to find the right car, which yeah. we still are on search for. Um, I definitely agree with that. They were, it wasn't a pushy type of atmosphere. Uh, they continuously said, you know, this is all about you guys and getting you in the right vehicle versus us just selling a car. And so that, that in and of itself says a lot. Um, I wish more car dealerships were like that to allow you to fully, truly test out a vehicle and make sure it's going to work versus you know you're coming a week or a month down and you're completely regretting your decision but now you're, you're stuck in with a vehicle. for 84 months no that's that's the reality right guys yeah. so um we are going to contact phil long value car off of academy um this probably tomorrow and just follow up where they're at mm -hmm. Um, because we really do like working with them. Um, we just, the price point and the vehicle they had, plus um, the, what we really want is not 100% um, right now. So yeah. we're going to wait this out and see where life takes us. So um, keep an eye open because yeah. you never know where we're going to buy, what we're going to buy. But I can tell you if I had the number one dealership to buy from in anywhere I've ever bought from, it would be Value Car by Phil Long 
and definitely work with them again. Um, Phil Long has been one of the best dealerships we have ever worked with. We did buy a car from them. I get it right, truck. Oh, sorry. That's yes, when we truck. had our 350. We bought our 350 <laughs> back in um, a 14. Yeah, I think so. Back in 14. And that truck was a really great opportunity for us to experience Phil Long at its best. Um, Phil Long worked with us for a brand new truck, did what needed to be done. Mm -hmm. Totally awesome. And that's exactly the experience we've had with them again. And I would say if I have to ever, ever recommend anybody to any dealership, Phil Long has been the best dealership we have ever worked with. They are family owned and they do truly treat you like family and that is key and i just can't brag anymore about how that's amazing for us so um i don't want to press you guys because um about the liking and the subscribing but at least share this video um you don't have to like or even subscribe to it just share it because in a card buying world where you either find a vulture or you find a family I would prefer a family. Yep, I agree. So, um, I hope you guys have a great day and um, journey on. Yeah, till next time. Bye, guys. Bye.